now that cinnamon is installed we can have some fun in the sense that you can install everything vanilla way meaning that um, you can well make it a little bit nicer we can already configure our menu here by using a custom icon you can look for another icon but we don't have any icons yet so we've not installed anything we can change already the name say whoa this is arch i need to fix my qwerty again cinnamon no that's not a m like so arch cinnamon and um, you can change those things if you want elements changed we can change these here that is okay for me so that's that we've changed this little button here we have no sound whatsoever we did not install anything it's a vanilla installation we can uh, investigate the network is installed so we are wired Control T is not working do we have a terminal we do not have a terminal the only thing we have is xterm that's because I installed it in uh, xorg at that point in time we got it so do we have internet arch linux dot arch agreed we have internet Control c to break it off so internet is there but there's no browser there now normally i would say let's do a git clone and get our, our elements from arco linux d cinnamon why not do it a longer way for a moment not for long because it's going to be ta like taking for a day or so to install everything and tweak everything plus just quickly install some stuff well, first of all xterm is not my choice of terminal so what if i installed sudo oh yeah the qwerty, the qwerty things first so qwerty preferences uh, keyboard 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 layout in HOS. no my friend belgian you choose your own of course belgian add english is out that's it let's see if i'm right azerty okay now we can start typing pseudo pacman minus s i like termite I like you know gnome terminal is i think the standard terminal for cinnamon meaning um, nemo will be installed that's no problem nemo is there so right mouse click gives us a terminal and you have normally preferences blah, blah, blah. where is the name help close help here about so the standard one in nemo is gnome terminal so that's installed already now for the look i don't like the look really so let's really focus on the look first i want to work on a nice machine Arc gtk theme or is it gtk arc theme arc icon theme is there as well arc solid i never tried that one arc solid gtk theme let's try a theme that i've never seen before so i'm gonna go to let's maybe put our themes here so we can change always quickly so what i take i take arc dark solids and that's not there arc dark solids okay how do i add that nothing there and arc dark solids so from now on this will be my look which is already better now did we install backgrounds do we can we change backgrounds because it's really ugly backgrounds well yeah we have backgrounds so let's take something else you know i like variety but that's all up to you you can set any wallpaper you want that's the easiest task ever now uh icons we don't have icons okay let's click here that works that is our gnome terminal the fonts are ugly um the fonts are ugly good question um yeah okay sudo Pacman minus S and let's take the Noto fonts. 
Not of fonts installed. Setting up the not of fonts. Mm, colors, no text, 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 text. Huh? Where are my fonts? Are ah, here. Custom font. No. <sighs> Stop it. Quit it. Quit it. And quit it. And open it again. Then check it again. Preferences. Why are my terminals not seeing in this thing here? Well, let's, I guess we need to reboot. Probably can do it another way with a command, but hey, five seconds later we'll reboot it. Takes me more time to remember again and look up what it was. Really like to auto login. Yeah, it's good. Uh, we were figuring out preferences. We did install fonts. So my question is, where are my fonts? No fonts found. Strange issue. Must be missing something. I did install it. Installed. Strange. Closed terminal. Okay, I went to investigate a little bit, and that's better to read here. I installed, let's maximize it. I installed TTF Deja Vu. So that's the name I the application that I installed. And we install that one. We can here have here the monospace regular. We have lots of elements here. Deja vu sans mono book. Let's make a little bigger. Select. Let's see how that looks. Control T is working. Yeah, Control T is working. So we are really on ground terminal. I don't like the look of this uh, top here. Oh no, it's uh, it's yeah, it's here. It is here. It is here. So I don't like the title on top. Show menu bar by default in new terminals. That's what I don't like. And what I don't like either, close, what I don't like either is, hey, see, hiding behind it, or oh, what? Edit, preferences, okay, there it is. Show scroll bar is something I don't like. So if we kill everything now, close, a little bit sluggish, Control alt t Okay, so we have now PKS YUA. Nope, does not work. Pseudo pattern minus S. Let's get everything in. And there we go. Worse, so we ha do have an update to do. All right, do it. So we have now a system that looks good. I can show you a terminal with some text in here. And um, well, the icons, uh, the icons. Uh, um, yeah, we have Yahoo installed. It's there already, but Yahoo is a bit um, yes, no, yes, no, yes, no answers. You know, you know what I mean. If you already used Yahoo, it's not really my thing. Added package build. So yes, I've always oh, damn. No, I wanted to say hop there you go again. Hop, restart. I'm getting too old to use Yahoo's, I suppose. So edit package build, I should say no. Continue building, I should say yes. Proceed, I should say yes. Continue installing, yes. And install, yes. Okay, fine. So now I have this application Trizen, and what were we thinking? We we're thinking about icons. Okay. Show me all the icons that Arch has. Let's take something. Orangello is also nice. Let's take something I do not know yet. Mocha, the motto icons. What's this? All right. Let's take one, two, four. Enter. Edit package build. Now I don't have to think. It's just enter, enter, enter with Trizen, and that's it. Now, up. So here, what icon theme did I install? Mm -hmm, a brown one. Okay, how does that look on my system? 
All right, this is Mato, which is actually basically, I guess, just a folder. I mean, folders are here, but not not the applications itself. So, bad choice. Control Alt Trizen Eigens. And there are 227 choices to go. You can, of course, also, uh, well, check out if they're coming from extra because they are, are already part of uh, Arch Repo, meaning they've earned their place, meaning they should probably be okay. So these guys, GNOME icons, Python, Sugar, what's this? At Vita icon themes, and here we're already in AOR. So these are from the users, the Arch user repository. Okay, that's another one I'm curious about, but we can't make the video so long. It should be okay. I would like to try this one. So it's new for me as well now. That's the fun of it. There are lots of things to try out and install and see if you like it. There is an error because of the validity check. Unable to build it. Do you want to exit now? Yes. So we can't build it right now. Unless I can say something like skip check or something. You know, if, if it's it was this or it was something else. Control C and then Tryzen. No manual entry, Tryzen. Help. No skipping anything. Check dependencies, yeah. In this case, Tryzen does not support it. Yahoo supports something similar as well. But well, it's gonna take us uh, out of, um, well, that's not the point of the video. Icons new mix. Come on, give me the new mix icons. Let's do this. How about Wicked icons? All right, <laughs> another experiment <laughs> that might go wrong. <laughs> but that's actually making your own system. That's building up your Arch Linux system from scratch. It takes time, it takes patience. And at some point you realize, I want that, I want that, and I want that. But sometimes then you forget to check out other stuff. This is my first time that I check out stuff in like months. There might be systems out there that are lovely and I don't know about it because really I don't have the time or don't make the time to check all these packages. So if you have a suggestion, if you say, hey, Eric, you should take a look at that one or that one, please let me know. You made some mistakes, I see. You made spaces in files and you shouldn't do that when you make icons. Never ever do that. Then you get these errors. Let's see. New mix white. There is new mix. What's this? Oh my god. It's again just the places. There are some icons that were changed. These are new mix icons. But my guess, maybe, maybe, um, maybe it depends on Tryzen new mix. Maybe these icons are working together with the new mix icons. That means I should, that's a theme. I really should get the icons themselves. Come on, this is taking too long. Let's do control Z, new mix icons. That's better. So one, we're not gonna take Saturday. <laughs> I think that's number one that I need. Although I just saw Arc was mentioned. No, it's okay. Because it says here Numix icon theme. Yeah, I think that's the correct one. And I'm hoping that the things that we're missing here, the icons that we're missing, 
that it will now be filled in with the new mix icon depending on what he did let's see yes whoa a lot of errors okay try again <laughs> won't do any good huh so no fail to work Pacman failed to install the missing dependency, so we wanted to get this. Couldn't get it. Control Shift C. Control C. Tryzen. Control Shift V. Let's have a look. Let's install that one first. This is the basic package, the new mix icon theme, and the other one is the circular theme. If the package build was built a different way, I'm guessing that my control C, that my last installation of the white one, is blocking everything. So I'm removing the no uh, new mix white or something. Yep, that's it. I'm removing this one, getting this one first. It's never easy, is it? But this is what we do behind the screens on Arco Linux. We check out things, install it, and then get into trouble and say, okay, we won't be using this, or we will use it, but we have to change it. We have to test all these things out. So that's one thing that's installed now. So we, it was definitely the Numix white icons issue. And I also want the circular one, which is the one. And then yes, yes, yes. And probably if we want to install the white one, it will say, I can't install it. But let's not dwell on this. It's just icons install so it can look like this new mix circle new mix circle arc is maybe also nice so we have an arc theme the tunar which is here for instance home well we only see one one folder but here they are the others so we can use this one or we can use that one and all these things are the same. We might want to use a other cursor. So you start by looking Trizen cursor. 144 choices for a cursor. Control C, you know what I like, is the one with snow. The breeze snow cursor theme. This is another one that we're using. Let's see if it works. Yeah, it's working. The zip is installing and if we activate it again but as you can see oh it's already activated so nice so here's my cursor now and then um, well maybe you like a conky we're already well we did not install Bluetooth printers network uh, network is installed uh, not Samba um, missing something so Network Samba, Con the connectivity of the network, checking out other computers in the networks, not installed. So I'm thinking about Arco Linux D slash Arco dash Cinnamon. All is in there, everything you need is in there. But you can build it up from scratch and start learning via the Arch Wiki. I need sound. So when you go, oh, we don't have a, <laughs> a browser. So let's go to the wiki, so the pacman minus s firefox. Default, yes. Um, we need a browser, we need conkeys, okay. Mm -hmm. Let's do those two. So, firefox. Holy, yeah, firefox. So, when you built everything up from scratch with this possible as well of course arch wiki sound and then you go look for the sound system you learn you learn you say okay there is pulse audio there's a sound surfer 
and then maybe yeah maybe if we click it and then I say installation front ends a lot of stuff install the pulse audio when it says that it says to you sudo pacman minus s pulse audio oops like so that's that and you have to continue reading for Pulse Audio to manage ALSA as well, install the Pulse Audio ALSA package. For Bluetooth support, you don't want that, you do want that. Equalizer, and you keep reading and keep installing. What I install as well always is the PAVU control, just because of my Bluetooth headset, it's easy to pulse, um, oh, what was it again, Pulse Audio volume control, that's how I remember it. So that's installed, that looks like so. It's a thing you see from time to time, so playback, recording, output, input, and configuration. Very easy to set up your Bluetooth, headless or Bluetooth device, headphones. So you can continue and continue and continue. I would like to have some conkeys. How about the Areola conkeys? Ah, uh -huh. long time not seen. Hi guys. Three months ago, I edited it. So let's uh, control C this thing. Right mouse click, open in terminal, that works. Git is not installed. So, sudo pacman minus s git. Git is installed. Git clone, control shift P, enter. We have now, no, not yet. It's taking too long. Control C again. Control C again. Keeps being slow. I'm not a patient guy. Oh, there he is. So that's a normal speed. So Areola has a is a collection of um, how many? collection of 19 conkeys and if we want to install it I believe we can install it by going inside there is this little script here that says get Aureola from github to local drive and that's actually the easiest thing to do so right mouse click open in terminal and let's take a look at the home and the control H. No, that's nothing. In here we'll make an we'll get in Confi, I think. No. In Eric. Three months ago. In Eric, I think we get a a folder. So we say get. It's going to do exactly the same thing. It's going to get everything from GitHub, but it's going to create a folder. And put everything in there so I don't have to do it. So here we have now this dot areola, which is a hidden folder, nobody sees it. Control H, it's not there. Control H, it's there. So we have the areola here. Whoops, it's empty. Okay, Ariush is asking a question here. Everything in folder areola will be deleted. Are you sure? Yes, because nothing is in there. There are all my, um, all my conkeys are in here. And how do we install it? How do we run one? We need to run Acres, but but did we think about um, did we think about the Conkey? Have we installed Conkeys? Don't think so. So I'm going to go to the terminal and say, "Hey, my friend, you forgot to install the Conkeys." Now there are two part two different kind of Conkeys. There is the Conkey, this one. And there's also the Trizen, Trizen Conkey, and remember the words Lua. And then you get nine selections, that's okay, right? Nine selections, and we take on Arco Linux this one. And that's the Git version, so the version that's normally supposed to be the most recent one. Um, because it says Git, right? But doesn't mean like, it doesn't mean that it's the most recent. Looking at the date, it might be. Anyway, if you're not going to use something graphical that requires Lua, so let's try Acris. 
you don't need an other installation. Now this Aureola thing is meant to be easy in the sense that we just run another script of course, you know Eric Dubois by now, install Conkey. So I say install Conkey and in the Conkey it says stopping all the Conkeys, checking everything is empty, the font is not currently installed, would you like to install? Yes please, because often fonts are what makes it nice, you know. Um, okay, blah, blah. Ah, LSB release is, is not present. So, Ctrl T, sudo pacman minus s. That's when what happens if you have a vanilla installation, you have to build it up. So, there you go. We have now the application that you were missing. And there we go, we have a conkey to the right side. Of course, it's from the days that I was using Linux Mint. So it has this Linux Mint uh, image in there, the logo. Now in config, in the conkey, there is just, well, this one conkey is available, just one in that folder. So there are already Arch Linux is in here, so that's good. So I go to conkey.conf. That's it. I choose a program. I don't have a program. <laughs> Control Alt T. I don't have an editor. Trizen Sublime Text. I could install um, Atom as well. Let's do that later. So Sublime Text Def number two. Okay. Now I can start typing. When that's installed, oops. And install everything. Control Alt T. So you go Pacman minus S Atom. When you're ready, maybe this one is even faster than the other one. No, it's locked. So first this one, and then that one. Okay, so we'll have two editors later on. So line text is there already. Okay, open it up zoom in, go down, somewhere it says Linux Mint, here, I believe it was Arch Linux, not sure, I'll see later, yep, that's the one, and we have Arch Linux here, and uptime, CPU temperature will never work because we're in VirtualBox, and all the information is more or less okay, Spotify is not installed, NSYNC is not installed, Dropbox is not installed, CPU usage we see, Ethernet will never be okay because Ethernet uh, elements, so control find Ethernet, and they are pointing to the name of a network device, so ENP2S0. Control Alt T. I have config, will probably not work. Uh, I have to look up what package again it was to have I have config. But there is also IP address or something. What was it again? Yeah, that's okay. It's good enough. So this thing is called here EPN OS3. And I'm going to look now again what package we needed for ifconfig. Or maybe let's look it up together. So let's see if we have still it here available. Make it bigger. Arch. Um, I have config package. Let's see what we get. No, I have config. Yep, that's true because it's part of another package. It's part of something. And uh, what was the package again? Those are the things we forget. Huh? Is that this one would be strange? An easy way also to find it. That's also maybe a good idea. We need to install it anyway. So sudo, no, not sudo, Tryzen, uh, Pamek, Iwar. Uh, let's try something else maybe. No, the, I wanted to try the Git, but the Git version is uh, older than the other one. So I'm going to num try number one. Enter, 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 enter. Oops, password. Oops. There you go, you know my password again. Uh, okay. I don't know what I did wrong. 
probably typed something wrong here. So one, yes, yes, and yes, and up okay. Even Ghost script is going to be installed as for printing. <laughs> what we did not do is tell the system to use all our cores. So it's working on one core and I have four cores. So it's taking more time. Check out Arch Linux about that. And there is a tutorial about boosting the power of your system. So. Pamac tray still finding out if config. So this thing here is now in here, and I wondered if I would if I type it here if we could find it out. No. Okay. So now we know that's not helping us. Close terminal. Yeah, let's close it one two. Close it two. We don't need this one because it's copy pasted in the dot config dot Aureola. And we're still looking for ifconfig. Is it part of this mlocate? Install the mlocate package. The mlocate. That's a locate package, that's something else. Let me look in order not to waste that time. I just found uh, an article about no IP, ifconfig, so interface configuration. And I say here, look, it's in the net tools package. So I'm gonna install that one. And I think if I remember correctly from a year ago or something, I do believe it was that one. So there you have it. IF config is part of net, let's say it again here, net uh, tools. This one. So now you know again, um, what my IP address or what my NIC network interface card, what the name is, what officially is the name and that one should point uh, in the com key to that name. That's it. Close my friend. Yes, close tab. So there you go. We have now a lot of possibilities. We have a wallpaper. It's not changing. If we want to change a wallpaper, I have a changing wallpaper. You should install probably variety, but I think it's in the normal arch repos. Minus s variety. Yep, it is. And each time you install more and more applications, all you'll get is a longer and longer menu. And that's fine. At some point in time, you might say, hey, Eric, I've done this vanilla thing. I would like to have some parts of your Arco Linux installation. So, all right. Control Alt T, git clone, HTTPS. And then we go to the github.com slash Arco Linux D slash Arco Cinnamon. That's that. We can close it up. Right mouse click is not possible. We need to really open a file manager. So Nemo, Arco Cinnamon. And what do we have here? So we have um, all the packages. Here is the information of the fact that we want to have a, let's make it a bit nicer, like so. I want still to see my conky. So much vanity in the world. So I want to have one, two, three. All use all the cores. I was saying to you that I'm using now my system with one core. Couldn't be any slower. Now I'm gonna use four cores. Couldn't be any so faster because my virtual box has said, hey, use four cores. And then the sound is 110, Bluetooth 120, 130, etc., etc. But I was saying I want to have some parts from Arco Linux. Then I need to go ls 
I need to go inside a folder, which is called Archway. And that's this one. I need to trust the key from Eric Dubois. That's done. And I need to add Arco Linux to the packages. Let me first show you sudo pacman minus s y by u. Okay. Four lines. We agree. I add it to the slash etc slash pacman.conf. And what happens if I reload? I get two extra lines Arco Linux repo and Arco Linux repo signing is applied. This means that sudo pacman minus s arch, I'm sorry, arco linux and on the wallpapers for instance, I'm gonna get my wallpapers in. So, closing everything up, I've just added one element. Let's change the desktop background. Let's see if we have the picture somewhere. Not really. So plus other location, computer, user, share, backgrounds, 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 Arco Linux. Open. And there they are. So let's fake it that we are on Arco Linux. So there you go. You have now wallpapers coming from Arco Linux. You can have conkeys coming from Arco Linux, but not together. I mean, we have a folder, Control H. We have a oh, we have a folder here, and what's in here? This conkey, it can be only or Arco Linux conkeys or Arco Linux. Uh, sorry, or Aureola conkeys, not two of them. That's um, that's that's how the way it is. So, right. Um, anything else I would suggest if you are on Arco Linux slash Arch Linux. So this is what we recommend. So display now is going to open Atom. I feel it in uh, how much time it needs to open it. So we have hashtagged out all the stuff we do not need. We do not need awesome configuration, neither open box stuff nor Genie. We have not installed Genie, but we might install Genie. Then you can install the settings as well. There are lots of themes in there for coloring for Genie. i3, we don't want i3 uh, settings. OB logout, open box, all these open box stuff. We don't want it on Cinnamon, but we do want Conky. So pipe menu is Conky, Plank. Oh, yeah, we could install a Plank. That's an idea. So, and for the rest, wallpaper, 6FC, Trunor, okay. So, Ctrl T, sudo pacman minus S, probably because you don't know any better, is Plank coming from AOR or is coming from Arch? Well, it seems to come from the, AOR, the Arch repository. Pacman minus S, Arco Linux, and plus, plus something, you know. Plank git and Plank themes. Plank git is the settings, the configuration of Plank. It's okay. Let's get the configuration from Arco Linux. And the other one is the about 100 themes, 80 themes, I don't know, a lot of themes. Like so. The files have been installed in .config Plank. Aha! Meaning we need to do something meaning we need to go to etc etc oh well, yeah yeah correct etc where is etc we are already in etc eric we need to go to scale then scale control h was already control h config plank is here and there's a setting there's Chromium and Peak and Firefox and Genie and GIMP, etc. If we don't want that and we want to start with an, our own uh, settings, then we just don't copy paste it and we'll get Plank anyway. 
Now blank is, let's kill it. Blank is coming if you take a good look and everything should be closed, you know. This is the amount of, of um, theming that's possible, you know. There's lots of themes in there. I haven't counted them yet, but I think it's around 70 or 80. We should count it. Anyway, we want it to have on top. And then we can start adding stuff in here and also keep in dock. Let's keep in dock. Let's keep in dock. Then we can have this in dock and so on and so on and so on. So we have here some kind of variety. Now, if you really want to know, as I really want to know now, how many themes do we have? Blank themes, control H, 81. 81 themes downloaded. Now, Alt T is not going to work. My, my keyboard to trash the wallpaper, I don't like this wallpaper. So I also like my keyboards, <laughs> my keyboard shortcuts. So shortcuts, add custom shortcut, variety, minus T. I can write here anything I want, doesn't matter. But this is important, variety minus T is going to delete my wallpaper and the assigned code for me and all the Arc Linux desktops is Alt T. So Alt T is trash the wallpaper, don't like it, Alt T and it's gone. So that's how you make your, um, how you set your keyboards shortcuts. How about this one? All right. I'm really an, am at the end of my story. I mean, there's still a lot to do to tweak your system, but I think it's also an, a good tutorial to show you how you can make a um, build up without all the scripts. You just run and experiment and Google and ArchWiki and YouTube things that you are missing that you want to have and learn and that's the fun in this I believe in Arch Linux and in Arco Linux you can learn and enjoy your system and get to know it piece by piece and, and you, you just decide yourself how much time you want to spend in it and if you say no too much time don't want to do this Arch Linux uh, story I just stay with Arco Linux a two gigabytes installation all fixed that's fine too so we have six phases and it's up to you which phase you want to be in but we do want that you enjoy yourself all right cheers